Finance, U.S. taps Leslie O'Neill as its new Chief Compliance Officer. Last, updated January 8, 2024, 331 ESD. 2. Min Read Disclosure, Crypto is a High-Risk Asset Class. This article is provided for informational purposes and does not constitute investment advice. By using this website, you agree to our terms and conditions. We may utilize affiliate links within our content and receive commission. Binance, U.S., the American subsidiary of global cryptocurrency Behemoth Binance, has announced the appointment of Leslie O'Neill as its new chief compliance officer. According to a recent announcement, O'Neill brings a wealth of experience to the role, having previously worked at Digital Identity Fintech Prove Identity for five years, where she served as Chief Compliance Officer for two years. Prior to her tenure at Prove, she also had experience in the traditional finance sector. As the Chief Compliance Officer at Binance, U.S., O'Neill will be responsible for overseeing the firm's Know Your Customer KYC, anti-money, laundering AML and sanctions programs. She takes over from Tammy Weinrib, who left the company in November after nearly two years. Interim CEO Norman Reed expressed his confidence in O'Neill, highlighting her expertise in fraud and identity and her successful track record in developing and managing compliance and legal functions. It is incredibly exciting to join Binance, U.S., at this important time for the company and digital asset industry, O'Neill said in a comment. I look forward to earning and maintaining the trust of our customers and regulators by building upon the company's strong foundation of compliance and deepening its commitment to accountability and transparency. Binance's regulatory issues. Binance, U.S., and its global parent company Binance have faced regulatory scrutiny in recent months. In June, the Securities and Exchange Commission SEC initiated an enforcement action against them, alleging the sale of unregistered securities. The SEC lawsuit named Binance founder Changpeng Zhao as one of the defendants, accusing him of controlling Binance, U.S., despite claiming it operated independently. In November, Zhao stepped down as CEO and pleaded guilty to an anti-money laundering violation, agreeing to pay a $50 million fine. Binance as a company also settled with the Justice Department, the Treasury Department, the Commodity Futures Trading Commission, and the Office of Foreign Assets Control, paying a hefty $4.3 billion in penalties. Amidst these regulatory challenges, Binance, U.S., has experienced executive departures. Former CEO Brian Schroeder left the crypto exchange in September, coinciding with a reduction in staff. Interim CEO Norman Reed, a former regulator with the SEC and the former chief legal officer and general counsel of Binance, U.S., has been leading the company since then. Additionally, the firm's chief risk officer, Sidney Majalaya, and head of legal, Krishna Javadi, also departed in November. Binance expected to maintain dominance. Binance is expected to maintain its position as the dominant global exchange even after reaching a settlement with the U.S. Department of Justice DOJ. According to a research report by broker Bernstein, Binance experienced minor outflows of less than $1 billion following the news of the settlement, but there was no significant panic among customers. Analysts at Bernstein, led by Gautam C.H. Ugani, highlighted that Binance's reputation with retail non-U.S. customers has remained strong throughout the crisis. Despite the settlement, Binance is expected to remain a material entity in non-U.S. markets. However, the report also anticipates increased competition from rivals such as Coinbase and new exchanges in regulated markets like Hong Kong and Singapore. Enter your email for our free daily newsletter or a quick three-man read about today's crypto news. Sign up. The site is protected by reCAPTCHA and the Google privacy policy in terms of service supply. IMG SRC equals HTTPS slash slash SIMG co slash p slash ML 300 JPEG all equals image class equals IMG ID equals newsletter pop-up IMG.